All right. So don't ever let anybody tell you you need this tool or you need that tool or you need to have a lift or a whatever. Oh, my butt. You don't need any of that. Honestly, I'd say half of the stuff I've done, I didn't even put on YouTube. So you guys are only seeing half of it. And then out of the half you're seeing, half of that was done in the front driveway. Literally, like, out in the sun. No canopy, no nothing. I'm talking here. The rest was done back here. And you saw how dirty it was before. No lift, no nothing. Just a creeper and a couple of jack stands from, you know... You buy Harbor Freight tools. You use them until they break. You take them back and you return them for another one because they're like, obviously it broke. You saw the name of the place when you walked underneath the sign to come in the door. It's Harbor Freight. They give you another one and eventually you break them enough to where you realize, I'm just going to buy a Milwaukee of this or I'm going to buy whatever your brand is. I'm not here to politic. But you get with the one you want. You keep that one and then you run it and then that's how you decide what expensive tools you need and what you're willing to pay for them by trashing harbor freight tools i mean i've i've smoked probably seven or eight of their angle grinders the four you know disc cutting wheel grinders and then finally i bought a milwaukee and i cannot remember when i bought that milwaukee cutting wheel i've and i've put miles on it hundreds of dollars worth of cutting wheels through that thing and it still runs like brand new every single time so do what you want do what you love that's the most important don't let anybody tell you what you need to do this is only your chance you're the only one responsible for the results and if you don't do what you want you're the only one to blame have fun keep on modding